Hey guys, Rob from Dingo Sandbags, and in this video, it's just a quick video, instructional video, to show you how to fill your sand ball up when you receive it. So basically, it's pretty straightforward, but when you receive your product, you get it flat packed like this, and then all you do is simply open the zipper up at the back, and then you pull out this um, funnel there, and then they pour the sand directly into there. So there's three layers to this product. You've got the outer layer, the elastic nylon, there's a middle layer of foam, which is for comfort, and then you've got the inner layer, which contains the sand. So all we do is open it up, and then open up that funnel there and pour the sand straight in. So the tip here, the most important thing is, is, um, is basically just have, not trying to pour the sand straight in there because you'll make a mess. Really, you just use an object, so you know, I either use something like this, just a, a container that's quite, with a narrow opening so I can get it in there without it spilling over the sides, or you can just get, you know, a kid's sand shovel, something like that, to scoop and put in there. So it's pretty easy, that's all you do. So I'll do that now. The only other thing that I'll mention is that when you fill it up, make sure it is to absolute capacity. So we'll just quickly fast forward this next bit of me filling it up and then I'll show you what it looks like once it's full and how full to get it. Okay, so I filled the bag up. Just a quick pointer here that when you think it's full, give it a good shake, give it a good tap and then fill it up even some more. Put another scoop in it, because basically you are aiming to get this full. That's how you get maximum functionality out of this product. So once it's full, then you seal off the top Velcro, make sure it's nice and evenly and flushly sealed. And then there's a second Velcro seal, which just holds that shut and that makes it, that's what gives it a really good leak proof result. And then finally, you've got that really solid big YKK zipper to lock it off there and you can tuck it away there. So that's it, that's the final product and as you can see, it's quite full. Now, let's put it to the test. So that should weigh almost 10 kilos. And the reason why it's almost 10 kilos, yeah, that is. So that's about just over nine kilos, and that's four. So, but what happens is as you use it gradually, the sand kind of pulverizes a little bit, and, it, and, and the bag stretches a bit, and then there's that little bit more room to then fill it up, and that would get to 10 after maybe about, you know, a month's worth of use. So that's, that's, um, that's your 10 kilogram sand ball. You do the same with the five and the 15 and your product's ready to go.